Hello guys, in today's video, I'll be telling you a few things that you should never do in EAFC Mobile. Enjoy. So the first thing is about the Star Pass. So if you're ever going to purchase the Star Pass, make sure you're going to grind and put your time and effect into it. And if you're not 100% sure, I suggest you only purchase it when you reach to the max level. Now guys, if you're ever going to rank up a player, make sure you don't rank them up unless it's 80% and over, since I've tried to rank up a lot of players at 60% and they all failed. Anyways, it's a scam. Don't do it unless you're 100% sure. Next guys, if you guys have a low-end device, then you really shouldn't be downloading the commentary files. These are a huge waste of phone storage and can make your game preform worst. But if you have a good device, you really don't gotta worry about this. Now guys, if you ever get FC points, don't ever spend them on these dumb token offers. Since most of the time you can just grind for them and they also super overpriced, you're better of spending them on player packs. So next, if you looking for a formation to use, Try not to use formations with three defenders, since this can make your defense very weak and course many more problems during your journey. So it's best just to not use them. Next guys is the exchanges. Yes, they offer you pretty good players, but the catch is, you have to sacrifice a million damn players. And the worst part, they sometimes have to be Pacific, for example. Where in the world will I find 11 Italian 85 plus over all players? Just think smart and don't do them. You're better off just buying the player at that point. Next, don't ever empty out your player's supply and only keep a few players. I suggest you keep at least 200 to 300 players just in case you get new player and you need to rank him up and train him. Next guys, when and if a new event is about to get released, you should probably stop spending your gems and FC points and save them, since when the new event get released, you can open a lot of packs at once and have the best chance. Next guys, if you're ever going to purchase a player, don't purchase overpriced players even if you have enough for them, there's why cheaper players with similar stats out there. Next guys, you should always avoid using the auto build feature when building your squad. This is because most sometimes it will put players in the wrong position and other things. It's just better to make your team yourself. So guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. And if you get this video to 2000 likes, I'll do a team of the year star pass giveaway. Damn, I thought that was going to be messy. What do you do? Uh, sauce up on you too. Uh, you know I'm dripping, baby. And you dripping too.